Hey guys, what's going on in Salvage here? And today we're going to be talking about Batman Telltale and what to expect from the third episode of Batman the Telltale series. Now, a lot had happened in the recent game, or I'm sorry, the recent episode and episodes, because one and two were very jam packed, crazy episodes. It was awesome. It was really, really fun. And I think it's going to change the future of the Batman uh, Telltale game of itself. So let's start off with episode one. A few things that's gotta do, you gotta brutalize some people, and of course Jim Gordon noticed that in the second episode. And you gotta do certain things that really made you look like a good guy and a bad guy. So not much happened that was crazy besides the fact that we knew that uh, Thomas Wayne and Martha Wayne and the Wayne family in general were helping Falcone and uh, Hamilton. The second episode was more jam-packed with more, uh, of course, decisions and things that will actually make Gotham look at you in a different light. One of them being going to see Mayor Hill and trying to interrogate him with Batman or even Bruce Wayne. I mean, Bruce Wayne, going in as Bruce Wayne, much more calmer. People don't know that you're Batman, so of course people aren't like, Batman went to go meet the mayor, you know? So people are just like, oh, well, Bruce Wayne went to meet the mayor or some shit. And I don't think anybody actually uh, knew that Bruce Wayne went, met the mayor. But of course, everybody knew that, uh, of course, Batman went to go see Mayor Hill. So that will leave a lasting impression for a while. Of course, Mayor Hill is dead, and, uh, and we really don't have a mayor right now, so... We're going to be seeing a very few type of people, especially the new mayors, be like, uh, Batman needs to go down because, you know, he just tried to, you know, interrogate the last mayor. So I don't want that to happen to me. Let's go after Batman. I feel like that's what's going to happen. If it doesn't happen, it sucks. But whoever's the new mayor is going to probably go after Batman uh, if you chose Batman to go after Mayor Hill in the second episode. And, of course, the final one is, well... Two-Face, guys, Two-Face, Catwoman, Two-Face, so if you went to go save Catwoman, uh, Two-Face, I'm sorry, Harvey Dent became Two-Face, or is going to become Two-Face, you know, he got his face burnt, but if you went to save Harvey, Catwoman gets shot and leaves, so there's two big possibilities here, one, uh, if Harvey Dent does become Two-Face or gets his face burnt, he'll become Two-Face in the next episode, sometime around the end as a big twist, be like, I'm the villain of Gotham, blah, 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 uh, you deserve to die, Batman, for not saving me. And then the other one would be Catwoman getting shot and Harvey Dent not becoming Two-Face. So Catwoman would be like, you know, very angry at Bruce, very, uh, uh, you know, very out for vengeance. I think that Catwoman would go after Batman for not saving her or going, going after Bruce or Alfred for not saving her. It would just be a very, very sucky thing for uh, having Catwoman on the bad side. Even though that Two-Face is going to be on the bad side of both Batman and Penguin, uh, Catwoman's going to be more on the bad side of, well, she already knows who Batman is. Uh, unfortunately, Bruce Wayne, I'm sorry, uh, fortunately, uh, sorry, Harvey Dent does not know who Batman is, luckily. So that means that Catwoman is the only person that could hold something against Bruce if you chose to save Harvey Dent over Catwoman. It's a big, big thing here. And there's nothing much else that you could... There's nothing more that you could really say about this besides, well, Batman is probably going to be having a choice to kill. I still believe that. That's still my theory, and I'm going to stick by it forever because Batman will kill. Batman will kill. Batman will kill in this game. So, as I said, what are you guys What are you guys expecting? Oh, yeah, 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 one more thing. You can expect Penguin to become one of the biggest crime bosses or crime family organizations ever because what well, we could see in a picture he's wearing a suit he's looking all nice he's smoking a cigar right outside wayne manor i'm sorry wayne tower so that means penguin is going to be a very good respected crime person besides just you know a revolutionist he's going to be uh, a bigger threat than just uh, revolution revolution and then the children of arkham of course are still going to be around and they're going to be giving batman some troubles and Kind of, I guess, causing mayhem, causing chaos, and destroying a lot of things that are, uh, you know, evolved with not only Mayor Hill, but still Carmel Falcone. They're going to probably go after the mob. Not only are they going to go after the mob, they're going to go after Wayne's. So, it's good. this is a huge, big thing that we cannot wait for. I can't wait for it, personally. And I cannot wait for this game to come out uh, sometime this month or next month. So, tell us guys in the comments below. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I'll see you guys in my next video. Peace out.